What's up guys and girls? This is a Guy and a Gee uh, to announce a new segment we're going to be doing here on Below the Belt MMA. It's going to be called the Monday Minute for now, working title, who knows where that's going to go. But pretty much all it is is going to be a recap of the most important news from every previous weekend in rapid fire fashion. No in-depth stuff, zero detailed analysis, not a whole lot of long thought out opinions. Rapid fire as a podcast for all that other shit. Just a quick, I need to know what the hell was the most important thing that happened this last weekend, and that's about it. So, that's the Monday Minute. We're going to see how it goes. Pardon the trash lighting. These first few episodes are going to come from a guest house in Indonesia. So, pro lighting and sound and everything is going to be somewhat garbage, I would assume, for the first few episodes. But hopefully we're going to try to iron that out as best that we can. And... That's about it. So without further ado, we got the first edition of the Monday Minute. Monday Minute. Okay, pretty much all that happened this weekend. Bellator 206 was the bulk of the news. You got Roy McDonald getting smashed by Gegard Mousasi, uh, proving all of our worst fears are true, fellas. Size does matter. Roy never looked close. Uh, it was Gegard pretty much coasting till Roy decided to aim an eye roll, and that was dumb. Fat Page Jackson, TKO's Vanderlei Silva, they both already said they want to fight again. Best of five, why not? The only person in the world that thinks that's good news is Tito Ortiz, because then if he wins, he has best of five hopes with Chuck. So Oscar's got potentially three more fights to promote. Lima versus Korshkov happened. Wasn't quite the barn burner I thought it was going to be. Lima's, I guess, still the second favorite to win the tournament, probably. Uh, I don't know if Gaston Bolanos is going to be good, uh, as good as his hype train people are saying that he is, but he's going to be fun, and we definitely need fun in MMA. Aaron Pico, thoughts on that fight? He's good. <laughs> Bruce Silver Doom said he didn't snitch. Uh, probably should have, because then he wouldn't be suspended till the end of time. AJ Agazarm said he's going to MMA. <laughs> and that's your Monday Minute for Monday, October... I'm feeling it, feeling the passion, it's happening. I'm feeling it, feeling the next pushing up on the side. I'm feeling it, feel the high that you get from the line. If you feel it, I keep it real in the most. I know you're feeling it. Crystals are nice, I like the toes, I keep on spilling it. Bone crushes, I keep real close, I got the skill for this.